Bryant fakes to nobody, then flips it out to Beatty. And Beatty finds the end zone. Mizzou football is replacing more than just a head coach this year. For the second straight season, the Tigers are also replacing a quarterback. That is the question that I that keeps me up at night. And yeah, that's the question that keeps me up at night. Mizzou has had some obvious talent in the pocket for two straight seasons with Drew Locke, who's now starting for the Denver Broncos, followed by Clemson transfer Kelly Bryant. But for the first time since the Matty Mock Drew Locke debate, the question of who will be starting for Mizzou at QB still needs an answer, and new head coach Eli Drinkwitz has plenty of options. Well, there's five quarterbacks involved in the, the quarterback race. Sean Robinson, we got Taylor Powell, we got Connor Baselick, we got Brady Cook, and we have uh, Jack Samsel. We're excited about what each one brings to the table. But with the pandemic shutting down spring practices, Drinkwitz hasn't gotten to see them in action much. I've uh, not seen Connor uh, do anything full speed or live. He, he was recovering from his ACL. I've been told he's full, but got no evidence of that. Um, you know, Sean, I thought in this three practices did fine. Um, Taylor Powell in three practices did fine. And Jack was learning the offense too. So th that to me is probably the biggest question mark on our football team right now. And these days, an offensive style depends greatly on your signal caller's style. So for a new head coach, not knowing your starter presents a major roadblock to building an offensive identity. Do you, because of the limited practice, go more to a quarterback run game offense? And yeah, run game, extra number in the hat. Maybe maybe Michael Wilson at quarterback some in Wildcat or Jalen Knox in Wildcat just to try to create an extra number because that's the stuff that's easier to do without uh, excessive practice and execution. Or do you try to stick to what the what you've done in the past? The good news is now Drinkwitz knows when he will be able to see them back in full action. The NCAA announced Wednesday preseason practices can begin August 7th, just a day after the coach's prediction. Not a lot of answers for you there and won't have any until I we get our hands on them and do things, which hopefully starts August 6th, you know, being able to do some live stuff where I can see him actually uh, compete for the job. And they'll need to work fast with the Tigers opener hosting Central Arkansas, currently set for September 5th. Reporting on Mizzou, Matt Vereen, Ozarks First.